major global semiconductor companies have expressed interest in India's ambitious semiconductor program and are likely to declare their plans formally in the near future. The announcements could come as soon as next week. This will add to the list of contenders in line for $10 billion in central and state subsidies as well as other advantages offered by India to entice semiconductor manufacturing in the country. Reports published last week suggested that India is mulling reopening the application window for chip manufacturers to claim support and subsidies, which was earlier open for just 45 days. You can watch the details by clicking on the suggestion video card in the top right part of the video. According to reports, currently three major candidates are being evaluated. If these plans go through, India could finally start breathing a sigh of relief as its efforts to rally support for chip manufacturing in the country would start yielding positive results. Ashwini Vashnav, the Minister of Railways and Minister of Communications and Information Technology, was on a three-day trip to Silicon Valley in the US, which is a hotbed for some of the world's biggest startups. On his visit, he is reported to have met with more than 60 companies in the semiconductor space. Upon returning, the minister said that there is a huge confidence about India's semiconductor program and that India has received interest from a number of large players. The entire ecosystem wants to come to India. The government is confident that it has the ideal mix of enabling elements, including financial incentives, top-notch talent, infrastructure investments, and supportive policies to draw significant investments in both core chip manufacturing and supporting units that make up the chip manufacturing industry. And this should attract players from all segments. According to a Bloomberg report, the government has also decided to keep the three proposals submitted under the previous window, the Vedanta Foxconn joint venture, International Semiconductor Consortium or ICMC and Singapore's IDSS Ventures, which totaled $10 billion in financial incentives with a 50% subsidy on investments for making semiconductors in India open to potential applicants. The government is yet to clear any of the proposals submitted thus far. Its efforts to invite large global players to India come at a time when India is attempting to become a significant player in the chip manufacturing ecosystem on the back of its large open market and skilled workforce amid geopolitical shifts, pushing countries to look at alternative supply chains to China.